Bill Hay, a celebrated figure in hockey and a key player in the Chicago Blackhawks 961 Stanley Cup victory, has died at the age 88. Hay, who won the Calder Trophy as the NHL's top rookie in 959-60, played a crucial role on Chicago's iconic Million Dollar Line alongside Bobby Hull and Murray Balfour. Together they led the Blackhawks to their first Stanley Cup win in 22 years and the Hayes contributions both on and off the ice helped cement his status as a hockey legend. NHL commissioner Gary Bettman paid tribute saying Bill Hay was born into a hockey family, won the Stanley Cup as a player and devoted his post-playing career to growing the game. Inducted into the Hall as a builder in 2015, Bill Hay lived a remarkable hockey life that reflected the very best of our sport. After his playing career, Hay ventured into the business world, achieving success in the oil industry. Yet his passion for hockey remained and he returned to the sport, eventually serving as the president and CEO of the Calgary Flames. Like his father Charles Hay, who was inducted into the Hall of Fame as a builder in 1974, Bill also served as the head of Hockey Canada and later became chairman of the Hockey Hall of Fame. This dual legacy made the Hayes one of hockey's most respected families with Bill's Hall of Fame induction in 2015 marking 41 years after his father's. In his 8th season NHL career, Hay accumulated 113 goals and 386 points across 506 games, demonstrating his skills and dedication. His legacy, however, extends far beyond these numbers. He was a lifelong ambassador for hockey, contributing to the sport's development and recognition on many levels. The NHL community mourns Hayes passing, remembering him as both a Stanley Cup champion and a champion of hockey itself. Well, that's it for now. Team US Most Read pays a humble homage to the departed soul. See you in the next video. Until then, please don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Thank you.